morning. You're welcome to the BNFT Digest. I'm Lily Pearl Baba Utu. Ghana's total public debt now stands at 109 billion Ghana cities as of July 2016, which translates into about 65.9% of GDP, according to data released by the Central Bank ahead of its 72nd Regular Monetary Policy Committee meeting. The figure is contained in a report titled Summary of Economic and Financial Data, September 2016, which says the debt stock grew from 101.1 billion Ghana cities in January to about 108.9 billion Ghana cities as at the end of July this year. So the idea of local government authorities issuing bonds to fund infrastructure development has been snubbed in Ghana, but investment banker Kojo Odai Mensa believes that when CEOs of local government authorities are elected, they will be forced to look at that option. Kojo Odai Mensa, who is the CEO of Data Bank, said this is an avenue for metropolitan, municipal and district assemblies to access cheaper and long-term capital to develop their communities instead of relying on central government almost in Tally. The Broadband Commission of the International Telecommunication Union has ranked Ghana as the third country in Africa with the highest active mobile broadband subscriptions. Globally, the report puts Ghana at the 51st position on a list that assesses the state of broadband development in about 179 countries. However, Ghana's broadband access position deteriorates when evaluated on the percentage of households with internet, with the country moving further down the table to 7th in Africa and 57th in the world. And that's all for today on the BNFT Digest. Visit the BFTonline.com or grab a copy of the BNFT newspaper for more stories. My makeup is by Juben House of Beauty. Enjoy the rest of your day.